Hello, good morning children. Welcome back to our English class. Now, last online class, I have taught you the activities. Now, I am continuing the activity with page number 22. Page number 22, second para. I hope the pencil is in your hand. Take down the meanings while I am reading it. Okay. A crab was crawling on the sand. Crawling means a pulling its body like snake. It is crawling and it was a walking on the sand. Okay. Her eyes fell on the shoe. By that time she saw one shoe. Then she peeped. Peep means a peep means a bend and look inside the shoe. Bending and looking. Okay. Peep into the shoe to assure. Assure means clear the doubt. Clear the doubt. Assure means clear the doubt. So, some meanings are there here. Assure. Assure are written here. So, clear doubt. Okay. And she made it her pretty home. She went inside that and she made it a pretty home. Next para. A crazy wave. Crazy means a wild behavior. Crazy. Here I wrote. Wild behavior. Okay. And took it back into the sea. Took the shoe into the sea. Waves means you know, no? Waves in the sea. It will be coming waves, Sarah. Came and took the shoe to the, um, back to the sea. And took it back into the sea. The crab was scared. Scared means uh, afraid. Out uh, and she screamed. Scream means uh, shouted. Screamed means uh, shouted. Can write the meaning there. Screamed means a shout. Okay. She quickly crawled out of the shoe. She came out of the shoe and swam back to the shoe. Swam means a swim. Swim. Swim means a Present tense, present, swam, past, okay. Swim, present, past tense, we are telling, past, over, no, that is a swam. So, swam back to the shore, she went back to the shore again. So, these are the paras which I read now. Now, you have to write the homework children. All the meanings I have given here. All the meanings I have given here, you have to take down in the textbook. Okay, textbook you have to take. Write that in the text and show me the answer. Are you clear? Okay. Next, open page 23. In this activity, you have to read it. Activity, you have to just read it. Activity 5. Now, activity 5, just to do read children, you have to read at home. Look at the following expressions from the story. Oh, my father, he had never seen his own face before. The underlying words show the ownership and relationship. Now study the picture given below. This is the picture. What is this picture showing here? It is a, it is a stall, book stall, sweet stall, toy stall. Okay. It is a shop of uh, toys, uh, sweets uh, and uh, books. Right now children? Yes. Now, seeing this picture, you have to 
prepare the sentence here. Okay. Now they have prepared. I will read. You have to look at your textbook. Look at the girl at the sweet corn counter. Her name is Vismaya. Which is the sweet corner? This one. There one girl is it. Look at the girl here. Do you know who is at the toys counter? His name is Varun. Toys counter is this toys. Here the boy is sitting and his name is what is his name? Varun. So this is Vismaya. This is a Varun. Who are the ones at the books counter? Their names are Fazil and Amala. Books counter to Children are there. Fazil and Amala. So these are the students here. My sweets counter as highest says. Says Vismaya. Vismaya is telling. My sweet stall is in a highest sale. More of, most of the sweets are being sold. She is telling. Our books counter is visited by the students. Says Fazil and Amala. Our book counter is visited by the students, uh, is told by Amal and Fazil. This is only the sentence, just to read. Okay, children. Now, after reading this, uh, you can read this remaining at home. Okay. Next page. You open this next page. Uh, page number 24, activity. See, I have written the activities here. Uh, you have to look this and write in your textbook and show me. Okay, can you see here? What did I write here? This is the words given in the box. You have to see that words and fill the blanks given here. Manu said, Mom, I am going to wash my hands. So you are taking my from this box and writing it here. E box liulla ella. Uh, akshara words na ili edon. Okay. So this you have to take that and write in the fill in the blanks. So these are the words. You have to fill this and send me the homework. Next activity 6. This is about the fisherman's lesson activity. Okay. Paragraph from a fisherman's lesson. So you can read this and uh, you have to answer the answer the box here. Okay. Now more is there for me to read here. So I I will read little two para. Rest you have to read at home. Activity six. Read the opening sentence in the story. The mirror. Long long ago, a fisherman and his wife lived on an island. It was a lonely island. See, some words are very bold. Bold means a very black written. Very, very darkly written there. Some words. No, which are there? A fisherman. An island. A lonely. These all are written very dark. Okay. The people of the island led a quiet and simple life. This is a sentence. Here, A is a bold. No. Bold A. Then the. Then an. These are called articles. What are they? Articles. A. And. The. Are articles. Articles. So, fill in the blanks will be asked uh, with the articles. That time you have to use uh, a and the. Okay. These are the articles. Last class I have told you ovals. No. What are ovals? Uh, many are confused with the ovals. A, E, I, O, U are ovals. Okay. Now here articles a and the. These are the Articles, you have to remember. In the articles only, some fill in the blanks are asked. You should be able to write. Now, after reading this para, they have given here one activity. Box, words with A. 
words with a, a are these. Okay. Here are the things I have told. Uh, you have to write the homework and uh, send me. Okay, children. So, which homework I have given you? Page number. Page number 24. No. Isn't it? 24. Yes. 24 till 24 I have given the homework and 25th one also you can write the homework also you have to write. Okay, see this the correct line write in the text and show. So till 25 you have to write and send me homework. Till that we shall meet in the next class. Till that, goodbye.